I'm Ray Worth of Water Walker Kayak. Today I'm going to talk about how to get in and out of your boat without damaging either your, your boat or your performance paddle. A commonly taught way to get into your kayak is to put your paddle out to the side like this and then sit on your back deck. The trouble with this method is that it puts a lot of stress on your paddle shaft and potentially your paddle blade. One paddle friendly way to get into your boat is what we call the cowboy method. In this method, I can swing one foot over and walk forward so that I'm standing near the front of the cockpit. And at this point, I'm just going to sit down, dropping my butt directly into the seat. The next step is to get my legs in. In this step, it's easier if, if I lean back and if I need to, I can use my hand to pull my knee back. Get the other foot in and I'm ready to go. To get out of my kayak, I can use the same method. Straddle the boat, simply use one hand in back to push up and stand up. Another way to exit your kayak, especially if the shoreline drops off quickly, is to um, exit side side. So in this case, I'm going to pull both feet out on the same side of your kayak, rotate so I'm sitting sideways, a hand in front and behind the cockpit rim, Roll forward onto my toes and push upward. So a good balance exercise um, for kayaking that can help you in a lot of ways is to get both feet out onto your deck and um, practice paddling that way. You can initially try it in shallow water and then work up your confidence. But it has uh, several uses, one of which I'll show you in just a minute. Race with a portage is one situation where getting your legs out early and continuing to paddle um, can help save time. 